So now you're going to grab, see if you can do this one, grab your back ankle. Yeah. That's where you needed the ball. Yeah. Ball helps a lot. <laughs> and then just see if you can stay upright. Stay upright. So this can be quite an aggressive stretch, uh, but we're trying to get at the quad more particularly. It gets my, my back right here. Okay. So then if that's painful, this it's may not, not be painful, something we want to do. If smaller. you tighten your abdominals, yeah. does that help to support your back? No. Okay. So we won't do that stretch with you. We don't want to do painful stretches. We don't want to sacrifice his back for his hip. And it's not There's other ways to stretch yeah. the quad, okay. so we don't have to do that one. Cool. Or we could see if you could do it on the other side. That's right, other side. So, just like so That's right. Yeah. So staying upright and just pushing forward through the hip. I'm going to take my hand and take this up. Yeah, I'll try that one. Yeah, I'll see that one. My back is a little bit tight. Now, I'm not sure if it's because I did an exercise today or... Right. I mean, this is a fairly aggressive stretch, and you may need to kind of build into doing something like this. But for people that are a little bit more mobile, um, this can be a really nice stretch to work into. Cool. But we haven't looked at Todd's back, so there may be some stiffness issues there, and he's just moving, stressing through his back as opposed to getting the hip stretch. Yeah. So that's one of the rules. Don't do it if it hurts. Yeah. Don't <laughs> so do it if it hurts. <laughs> So another stretch for the quad, since that one was uncomfortable, is laying on your side. So facing me, head up on the roller, just bending your bottom knee a bit for stability. And then if you grab your back ankle, so there, yeah. is that a more comfortable oh, yeah, this way is to stretch? Awesome. Yeah, so the body's more relaxed here. You're not having to deal with the balance and stability. Uh, and we just want to make sure you're not overarching here and you're feeling a stretch through the thigh. So ideally, we want to try to get into a straight line with the body. Okay. If the lateral hip structures are tight, you'll see your leg might want to be here. So we want to try to keep, keep the leg low. Whoop. <laughs> There's some stability <laughs> there too. So quad stretch.